Going into sales from a telemarketer, I just wanted to figure out a shortcut on how to get the most funded loans. And so my training session was not weeks on end and you know, in a nice facility like this. My training session was probably a room about the size of that, real small closet sized room, and I was given eight VHS cassettes of Dale Vermillion. Dale Vermillion still does training online, definitely a good resource to look up. And he taught me how to sell benefit rather than fees and rates. That training took place back in, I wanna say maybe 2003, 2004. I'm very thankful for that because I picked up a lot of lessons. Keep in mind that I had enough excitement, enthusiasm as you do right now. With all the information you're learning, the new language, the new terms, the new abbreviations, I knew that that was my bridge to get the same money that these other loan officers were getting. Get the same freedom, the same rewards and accolades that these top producers who at the time were like gods to us. You know, because you're just in the CSR and you knew that only a few can make it that far. And so I was given the opportunity to make it because I was pretty craftful with my delivery over the phone. I never actually did business with people in person. It was all made basically telesales. This was out of the corporate office in Orange and I became a loan officer after, of course, watching those eight video cassettes and I was put on the floor. There was no actual training. There was no guidance. You know, it wasn't the thing to do to do a shadow or call in. And I didn't really have too many resources. It was really just older people way beyond my age. And all I wanted to do was figure out how do I get a sale quickly and make enough money where I can buy the Mercedes Benz that I just saw this other kid driving, right? And so diving into the research, of course, I was getting shut down because the traditional training was just talking about like smile and dial, right? It's a numbers game. Right? Like if you get a hundred, if you call out a hundred times, you're supposed to, you know, land mathematically with like a 5% or 4% conversion rate, you'll obviously hit one of them. And in my opinion, I was kind of lazy. I always looked at kind of sales as a game and I knew that there were cheat codes. I knew that there were hack codes. What I did was I tried to figure out different ways to hack the potential. So in other words, when loan officers were on the dialer, I was actually calling out. And a lot of loan officers, even to today, why I reference this is because a lot of our competitors simply don't call out. They give it one shot and if they get turned down, sometimes the loan officers are inexperienced enough to know that they can call that lead back or at least retain some sort of excitement to engage with them again. Connected to Sales Remastered.